that uh, they had uh, some secret arrangement that they would still allow Jonathan to another four years, just one term, and he gave a pledge to them. They haven't uh, expatiated on this yet, but it was revealed by at least governor of Niger State that there was this uh, <coughs> pledge that you do one term, but it makes you think, really, how could leaders be trusted if they cannot honor simple, simple agreements? We are now saying that since there is no consideration of morality and so on, the North is going to insist that uh, the presidency will come whether on the basis of rotation or on the basis of voting power. Another Fulani who had used our money to overthrow democratically elected government, a corrupt Fulani, General Muhammad Buhari, very corrupt, highly corrupt, rotten, made this statement. God willing, by 2015, he made this statement, May 15th of May 2012. God willing, by 2015, something will happen. God willing, by 2015, something will happen. Emphasis. They either conduct a free and fair election or they go a disgraceful way. If what happened in 2011 should again happen in 2015, by the grace of God, the dog and the baboon would all be soaked in blood. That a man who overthrew a legitimate government continue to threaten us with blood and nothing has happened. Who is this criminal who took our guns or our resources to plan and overthrow a legitimate government? without any reason whatsoever. And we will march violence by violence. We will march intrigues by intrigues. We will march bullet by bullet. We will march blood by blood. We are ready for them. Good Lord Jonathan will complete his tenure of two terms, whether they like it or not. To us, they don't even exist.